right, welcome back. You're watching Deal TV. Uh, we still have open lines. So if you have an item you'd like to list tonight, whether it be a riding lawnmower, which is a, one of the hottest items people are looking for right now, if you have a riding lawnmower that you would like to buy, sell, or trade, get on the phone lines right now and tell us all about it, and maybe we can find you one, or if you have one that you'd like to sell, we can do that also. We've uh, been pretty, pretty lucky about selling a lot of items here on the show. The only thing we ask is if you uh, want to come on and... and uh, promote a deal that it be a deal if it's full retail and it's not a, a new item that's not really much of a deal so uh, we kind of would like uh, the items to be of of great value and of great importance to the people that are out there looking for those items so if you have an item that you'd like to sell it's been around your place for a while and uh, you may even think it's junk it may not be junk for those people out there watching the show tonight we have a pretty big audience that do like to watch and you know I get more people tell me they watch the show than people that actually call on so we've got a viewing base they may not always have anything to sell or or uh, want to trade for but they're out there so if you have an item that you ha that would like to get out there tonight uh, that audience is probably waiting for that item and uh, this show being unique in a in a prime time television viewing uh, part of the day uh, there's different people that are watching television that, that don't necessarily listen to morning radio. So here's a, here's a great alternative opportunity for you to uh, call in and get your item listed. Call one of the numbers on the screen in the Harrison area, 870-741-4891 or 870-424-6957 in the Mountain Home. If you're out of either one of these areas, just pick a number and start calling. Uh, there's some events happening in and around the area. You know, last week we had the Crawdad Days here in Harrison. It was a hu huge success. And uh, after those events, the summer kind of uh, school lets out, and people kind of go all different kinds of directions. They're out of pocket, and your friends that used to talk to you every day are vacant, absent, and uh, usually on some kind of vacation or trip or, or dealing with the, their children or something. So... The events are a little bit few far between, but there are events that's happening in and around the area. We can tell you a little bit about those. There's going to be, uh, let's see, let me move on down here. Uh, Two-person scramble uh, uh, put on by Community First Bank, United Way, and FedEx. It's a two-person scramble. It's going to be, it's the ninth an annual Magnus Toyota Horse Race. It's a skills game. Sign up and you can register Saturday evening. Uh, there's a... Um, a thousand dollar shootout, and it's ten dollars to win. The times are Saturday at eight thirty uh, and one thirty, and then also Sunday eight thirty and one thirty. And this event is June fourteenth, fifteenth, and sixteenth. This is a two person scramble, and if you're into the into golf, then uh, you can get your team together. And I think the teams are. Let me see. Uh, I forgot what the team. How much was it? Oh. Uh, $200 for team entry fee. Also, they have a hole-in-one on the number 5 green on Saturday, June the 15th. Wins a 2013 Buick uh, courtesy of Ben Eddings. If you can get that hole-in-one, you win that brand-new 2013 Buick. Uh, let's see. You can sign up early. Limited number of teams, 72 maximum. Prizes on all pars, uh, all par threes. Refreshments and burgers all day on the course on both days. So if you're interested in this, this is uh, for the United Way. And for more information, you can contact, let me see if I can read this. Oh, let's see. Community First Bank and contact Debbie Murphy. Sorry, guys, I do not do not have a phone in front of me here. I don't have a phone number for that. should be one here, but on their flyer, I do not see one. So if you want to contact First uh, a community First Bank in Harrison, Arkansas. They can give you more information on how to do that. Okay. All right. And also have a uh, Boone County Biggest Losers competition put on by New Fitness. It's a weight, weight loss challenge. A uh, grand prize is $1,000. Now, they did this last year. And uh, sponsors are Dixie Cafe, Nature's Wonders, and Rebecca Lynn Simon. And for more information, you can contact uh, New Fitness. And I don't have information on that either. I apologize. I don't have phone numbers. I'm, 
I'm surprised these flyers have all of the information there, but they don't have the phone numbers to go along with it. Apologize for that. We'll try to get that a little bit later on. And then over in Mountain Home, there's Overcoming Compassion Fatigue, a seminar for service, service providers uh, from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. Friday, June 14th at the Baxter Regional Medical Center at the Lagerborg Dining Room. You learn more about uh, mental exhaustion symptoms, causes of, of the symptoms, stress and burnout, depleters and replenishers, maintaining effectiveness, methods methods of resolution, personal vision, seven res- resiliency skills, conflict res- uh, resolution, and self management. This is put on by FBI Chairman or Chaplain Joe B. Williams. We're sharing techniques and information that he has gained throughout his personal involvement with the aftermath of the Oklahoma City bombing and the 9-11 tragedy in Hurricane Katrina. Uh, For more information about that, I do have a phone number here. Uh, You can call Legacy Hospice at 870-895-2651. Hospice of the Ozarks at 870-508-1771. Or you can call... I'm sorry, it's too small. One of those numbers will suffice. Do we have any callers? Is our phones working tonight? It says for, uh, phones were for uh, missed two calls. Sorry. If, uh, anyway, okay, we had a little phone problem there. So you could start calling now if you were not able to get through. 870-741-4891. Call that number if you'd like to get on the uh, be the first to call in tonight. Or if you want to call uh, from the Mountain Home area, 870-424-6957. And we'll get your call. Hopefully we will. Let's see, is there any more? Yes, 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 yes. We'll tell you about the Brandon Burlsworth Foundation, the Brandon Burlsworth Football Camp, which they do every year. And this year it's going to be in two places. It's going to be in Harrison at the F.S. Garrison Stadium uh, Friday, May 31st. And uh, that's on Friday. And then on Saturday, June the 1st, it's going to be down at War Memorial Stadium Stadium in Little Rock. And if you uh, have never been a part of the football camp, it's for youngsters. And what they'll do is uh, 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 football players from the Razorbacks and professional leagues will be there to, to, be, to do one-on-one skills and evaluations throughout the day. Now you can learn the game from former Razorbacks. For more information on this, you can you can contact or go to the website brandonburlsworth.org. Okay, now let's go to the phones. We do have a caller. Brian's on the line. Welcome, Brian. How are you doing tonight, Dan? I am doing just fine, but I can't hear you very well, guys. How are you doing tonight, Dan? I'm doing just fine. Well, I can hear you just fine on that TV. <laughs> oh, you can. Good deal. Oh, yeah. What you got, Brian? Man, I got a lot of items for sale. I'm having a moving sale. A moving sale, boy! You're the movingest guy. Every time you call in, you got a moving sale. <laughs> what do you move for? Well, do you move from? No, I'm talking about this man. Woman's got a moving sale going on. Okay. Hey, hey, Brian, phone. Brian, could you turn your TV down, please, so we won't have that echo going on? How's that? That's good. Okay, what's your first no, item? Oh, yeah, I've got several items. I've got uh, their couch over here. I've got their chairs. Couch, chairs. I've got a leather, I got a, I got a leather um, chair set. i got a china hutch and things for sale. i got a Ford Ranger for sale. All they got to do is call me, and I'll tell them more about it. Okay. All right. There's no sense you sitting there writing everything, I mean, you know, typing everything well, I'm in. I'm up to date. You got Your to hands would get tired, man. No, I only use two fingers. <laughs> Brian, you calling from Harrison, right? Yes, sir. All right. What's your phone number? Uh, boss, uh, uh, let me put a G, uh, it's a G3, uh, 3G uh, iPhone on there for 200 A T3 iPhone. Yes. For $300. No, two hundred. Oh, I thought you said t- three. Okay, trying to make yes. an extra hundred dollars. Two hundred dollars. Okay. There you go. Is this new or is it used or? Well, actually, it's used, but it, is, it looks brand new. Okay. No, I mean it was brand new when they just shipped it out the other day. Oh, okay. Well, me, it's a buddy of mine down there at the pawn shop. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh huh. Okay. 
sold it to me. So you got an iPhone for 200 bucks. all right. Anything else real yes. quick? No, sir, that's about it. They can call me for more information on the stuff. Okay, phone number. It's 870 four, well, excuse me, 414-3323. Uh -huh. three, three, three. Three, three, two, three. We got it. Thanks, Brian, for calling in. Yes, sir. Thank, thank you. Again. All right. Have a, good, have a good one. That was Brian calling from Harrison. He's having a moving sale. He's always got a lot of stuff to sell. Uh, he has a couch, a chair, a living room set, a leather chair set, a fire hutch, and a Ford Ranger he's got for sale. He also has a uh, T3 iPhone, like new, for $200. Uh, from any of those items uh, that he mentioned here on the show, you can give him a call in the Harrison area at 870-414-3323. That number again is 870-414-3323. Now, if uh, there's items that uh, you missed tonight, you can always go back to our website or our Facebook page and check those items out if you miss something. Uh, this is our first caller, so you haven't missed anything yet. But but uh, we are here to serve you. Let's see who's else on the line here tonight. Oh, boy. Let's see. Move this over. It's in the way. Okay. Ed is on the line. Welcome, Ed. Hello. How are you? I'm doing fine, Ed. How are you? I'm pretty good, I guess. I've got a... Uh, well, uh, Red Cedar Bedroom Suite. Okay. It has a chest, dresser with mirror, headboard and footboard, and it's got a pretty clean mattress and box springs with it. Clean box springs, head, and footboard. All right. Now, this is, so is this solid wood? Yes. Solid cedar. Uh-huh. Okay. And how much did you want for that? Those items? Uh, I want 300 on that. For 300 okay. And well, I've, also, I've also got a Roper refrigerator that's about two years old. I'll take 150 for that. Two years old? Well, about two. I don't know if for sure. Yeah, that's okay. okay. 150 Uh-huh. Anything else? And I've got an old treadle type sewing machine. One of them that you pump for your feet? Yeah. yeah. I'd take uh, 60 bucks for it. It needs work. Is there a brand name on it? Is it, is it a singer or no? I think it's a singer. I'm not positive. Okay. Well, we won't say. We'll just say it's a treadle type. Singer made most of those back in the day. Anyway, that was the most yeah. popular one. And you want sixty dollars for that? Yeah. All right. Anything else, Ed? That's all I can think of right. right now. Where are you calling us from, Ed? I'm calling you from Belfire, Batavia. Okay. And your phone number? It's eight seven zero seven one five seven four zero three zero three. Uh -huh. All right, Ed. Thanks for calling in. Appreciate it. Uh huh. You bet. Good one. Uh huh. Bye bye. That was Ed Colin from Batavia. He has for sale a uh, red cedar bedroom suit, uh, chest dresser with mirror, clean mattress and box springs. Comes with a head and footboard for three hundred dollars. That's all inclusive, and it's a solid red cedar wood with that. He has a Roper refrigerator. It's two years old. He'll take $150 for that. He said it runs good. Also has an old treadle-type sewing machine. He thinks it's a singer, uh, but there's no electric. You uh, do all the, all the movement with your foot, and he'll take uh, $60 for that. He's located in the Batavia area. You can call Ed at 870-715-7403. That number again is 870-715-7403. And it took a while for people to get going, or maybe people were going, we just weren't getting them. We had a little trouble with the phone earlier in the show, so that's probably why we were dead in the water. All right, let's go back uh, to the phones and talk with David. David, you're up, buddy. Hey, man, how you doing? Doing great. How are you? Fantastic. Great. <laughs> Tony the Tiger's on the phone, folks. <laughs> What's going on with David? Called a lot. Huh? What's going on with David tonight? Hey, great things always. Good, good. 
You would be great on a on a on a uh, lifeboat. Oh Always thinking yeah. Positive. Oh yeah. Yeah. And radio. I used to be on radio. You did used to be on radio. Well, you got to think on your feet on radio, don't you? Oh yeah, Rock and Diamond Dave was my name. Diamond Dave. Wow. Rock and Diamond Dave. Rock and Diamond, and you did country music, right? No, no, I did uh, live promos. Oh, that's all you did was live promos. Yeah, and some reporting. Oh, okay. All right. So we're going to cut to cut live to uh, Rock and Diamond Dave. <laughs> <laughs> what What have you got to sell for us, or what are you looking for, David? Hey, I've got uh, approximately uh, four items. Approximately would be almost. Yeah, either three or four. <laughs> okay, all right. Approximately four items, and I'm going to give you four items tonight. Okay. Okay. First up is, uh, I've actually got two of the same size. They're called Native American gouache paintings. W-A-S-H, They're gouache paintings? Gouache, G-O-U-C-H-E. G O U S A G H O C H E C H E. Okay. The gosh, one painting. Gosh. Gosh, gosh. It's, it's pronounced gouache, watercolor painting. Okay. And uh, they're two, both of them are by famous Native Americans. Some of the two of the most famous Native Americans who have their paintings hanging in museums. Okay. The first name is B. Gay. B E G A Y. Okay. And the other one's Yaz. A Yaz. Y A Z Z. Yaz. Okay. Yeah. And I was asking two hundred dollars each on. They're about eight inches, eight to nine inches tall, and about five to six inches wide under glass and frame. Okay, five to six inches. And they are they are authentic. Okay. They were painted between the date of 1910 and 1950. Okay. Did you say 1910 to 1950? Yeah, in that range. In that range, okay. All right. How long have you had them, David? I've had them a couple weeks. Okay, so you do you trade, buy, and sell, and, and deal yeah, with people. fine art? Yeah, I, I buy and sell just about anything, and some people give me things, yeah. and I See, sell. And some people that do that are, are pretty, uh, they're pretty versed in certain areas, and, and you've been on the show before uh, with paintings, so uh, do you like that medium, and uh, do you like... Oh, yeah. Okay, so you, you're pretty proficient in that area. Yeah, I started learning back in the 60s, 1960s when I was a kid. Mm-hmm. I learned about prospecting and treasure hunting and coins oh, and yeah. antiques, collectibles, That's artwork. Yeah. Okay. And you want a hundred? See, so you want two hundred dollars a piece for these? Yeah, they're worth more than that. Actually, are. Okay. All right. Anything else? That's your first I, two items. That's your. Now, would you consider that two items <laughs> that you're trying to sell, or or maybe one? Is this where your well, four items come in? <laughs> I just got a lamp and a pitcher. Or excuse me, a lamp? two more pictures and a lamp. Two pictures and a lamp. Okay. Yeah, a lamp is, I don't know how old it is, but it's solid brass with the center. Seems to be marble. Uh, it's got a, uh, the, there's a center in it. It's marble, marble center. I believe it's marble. I'm not sure, okay. but I know the rest of it's brass. Okay. All right. We'll no, say it's marble until somebody debunks it as not being marble. <laughs> it's heavy. It's a beautiful lamp. Okay, well, it probably is. Yeah. Probably is. Uh, I'd say asking uh, uh, $10 on that. $10, okay. All right. What else? Uh, and then there's a, seems to be, it's under glass framed, a, a map with a signed artist, South American artist, Drew. Canada, the United States, and Central South America. It's kind of a hand-drawn map. Okay. Uh, hand-drawn. So this was... It's colored. Okay. It's called Ameriki, Ameriki du Nord 
uh, El Central. <laughs> and the signature of the artist is on the lower middle. So you call it the uh, Ameriqui du Nord El Cent Central. Central map. It's, it's got Alaska, Canada, and the United States. I'm not even going to touch South that. Okay. <laughs> just delete that. Okay. They can call for now information. Asking uh, $10 on that. $10, okay. Well, that sounds pretty cool, a hand-painted, hand-colored map under glass. It looks like it's hand-made. It's signed there, so I okay. thought, hmm. Well, okay. okay. All right. It's pristine condition, very beautiful. Okay. And what's your last one? Uh, I have a, what seems to be a poster with typewriting stuff on it. It's called... The title of it's called The uh, First Step. And it's got two dogs and a farm girl with a farm in the background, colored. Okay, farm scene. Yeah. It's got typewriting underneath and stuff and okay. names of the makers. And okay. These would be perfect if we had a photo of them and we could just show people what they look like. I know, I was trying to figure out, uh, I was trying to learn my phone, and I could take pictures, but I tried to figure you out how to here's how, you, here's how you do it. You, you uh, take a picture, save your, save your picture in your phone. Right. And then when you want to, uh, you can add a contact, and okay. you can add an email, or you can just add our phone number if you'd like. And okay. We'll, let's see, can we get it that way? It's going to take longer if you do it by phone. So if you, if you... Do a email address at okay. dealtv at k26tv.com. That's dealtv at the letter K, the number 26, 26. The, the, the letters TV, TV. Dot com. TV? TV, like in television. Okay, dot com. K26TV.com, and then uh, when you open that up, you can attach it and send it right to us, and then we'll get it. Okay. And you can even add a description to it if you want to. Okay. Right. Now, how much did you want for that farm scene? Uh, $10. For $10, all right. Now, did we uh, get to um, the approximation, or did we get to the approximate number of items you have tonight? Well, approximately four. Okay. That's <laughs> five. Yeah. Kind of five. Four. Okay. All right. Was that it for you tonight, David? Yeah. Okay. All right. Who are you calling from again? Well, I, could I put one more item sure, in? Sure. We've got a slow night tonight. What do you got? I've got a, a high definition VHS and DVD player and recorder. It records on both. It's a Magnavox. So they both record? Yeah, it's, it's a high definition. Magnavox uh, okay. player and recorders and both. Okay, all right, good. And it's got the original uh, remote. Okay, and how much do you for that? $20. $20, it's not bad for a recorder. No, this is uh, top of the line. All right, and where are you calling from, David? Mountain Home, Arkansas. Mountain Home, all right. And the phone number? Uh, area code 656 0365. All right, we've got all that information. I'll try to read it back here. And you have a good evening. Thanks for calling in. And hey, call God bless, man. Hey, God bless you. And call back again sometime. Okay, thank thanks, you. Man. All right, that was David calling from Mountain Home. He has approximately four items, maybe five. Uh, let's see, he has two same size American. Uh, I'm, I'm going to forget some of these things that I phonetically typed in because I don't know what they are, but it's a painting, it's watercolor painting by Gay and also by ja uh, Yaz uh, for $200 a piece. They're approximately 8 inches by 5 to 6 inches uh, framed under glass. Uh, they're authentic and they're painted by these two artists that I mentioned earlier, D. Gay and, and uh, Yaz, and they're uh, well-known Native American painters, and he's asking $200 a piece for those. 
Also has, uh, and he also said that they were painted between 1910 and 1950. Don't know exactly what dates those are. It also has two pictures and a lamp. The lamp is solid brass, uh, has a marble centerpiece, and he'll take $10 for that. Also has for sale uh, under glass frame, hand painted. It's a drawn map. It's a colored map, and he'll take uh, $10 for that, and it's in pristine condition. Also has a... Uh, type written uh, t- I, I'm not sure what I wrote here it sounds like another painting and it has some typing on it it's called first step it's a farm scene and he'll take uh, $10 for that these items really need to be seen to appreciate uh, as you can tell from our struggle trying to deal with the American uh, uh, language and uh, trying to find the descriptive words to, to get the pictures into your head which is almost impossible. Uh, he'll take $10 for that if you're interested in any of these or want to know more maybe uh, maybe David can take a picture and send it to you and, and uh, give you an idea of what it really looks like. Uh, he also has a an HD a high definition VHS and DVD recorder. These are recorders and players. And uh, it's made by Magnavox and it comes with the original moat. He'll take $20 for that. You can reach David in the Mountain Home area at 870-656-0365. That number again is 870-656-0365. We will take a break. And when we come back, we'll be talking with JD. He's on the phone. Hang in there, J.D. We'll be back in a minute or so. We'll talk to you in just a short period. Stay with us.